So, using my Christmas gift from my dad for for some wintertime drink, huh? Meanwhile, on Johnson's Garage, you're like. <laughs> There's a sweet tea with some Jack Daniels. <laughs> Keeps you warm. I'm gonna have to go. Got that, that has cinnamon flavor. <laughs> now I gotta go get my drink, cause. Uh, <laughs> oh my God. Is this, is it, is this is strong? No, it's perfect. You know what? That's really good. <laughs> I know. Oh my God. <laughs> so uh, me and Adam are uh, doing a little maintenance on the truck. He's putting some socks on. I gave him a pair of my wool socks. Yeah, we're doing some neglected maintenance. <laughs> yeah, we're going to change the transmission oil out and uh, change the engine oil. Oh, you were <laughs> he's got two pants on. I always do that. I, I hate being cold. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I'm going to get my other jacket on. I don't. I got to get a pair of thermals that fit me better than those, so... They kind of fit me, they're a little tight, but they should fit you just fine. Oh, just, the, just the zipper, the zipper's messed up. I don't know if it still has the... I don't know if we could ever figure that out. We could probably get it to work. I bet I can get it to work. I just got this one. If I got that one, I could get it to it work. Just, it just comes undone when, for whatever reason. You have, to, you have to go back up and then... Oh, it's okay. Yeah, it's all worn out. That's okay. But it'll keep your legs freaking warm, that's for sure. Okay, so... That's what really matters. Is this the front of it? Yeah. I'm a little confused. Oh, why, why are you confused? I don't know, Jimmy, because because I told you to do something and you did what I told you and, and now I you're in trouble. And I vaguely told you how to do it and now you don't know how to do it, so I'm going to yell at you and ask why you for it. Why are you doing it that way? Because that guy told me that uh, but I should do it. Why did he tell you that way? I don't know. I can't explain life to you. Check out Windbreaker gra Grandma and Grandpa got me. My sweater. Another sweater. And another sweater. <laughs> and then I got a shirt on under here. <laughs> Hell, I'm ready. <laughs> you got that. You're ready for minus 32. No, I'm kidding. Oh my god. I got these on. Hell yeah. <laughs> I got these. Yeah, those look like they fit you perfectly. You change your mind about them. You're like, they're just. They, they're too tight on me. Oh, you're just like. Oh, yeah. I, 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 yeah. My crotch is like. <laughs> it's like now instead of having testicles, I have ovaries, so. Oh, that. <laughs> wow! <laughs> I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> Did it break free? Yep. You know the only thing that's getting wet right now? My fucking my fucking socks. <laughs> my shoes have holes in them. <laughs> yeah, I got the other ones bitch. dirty that you gave me. I gotta clean them up. Oh but yeah. I I had the misfortune of stepping in a bunch of mud with them. Oh shit. the wind blowing today? We'll find as soon as you pull out a big gut, east wind comes in. I do not want to be wearing it this time. Oh! That is black. <laughs> well, it is a diesel. <laughs> no. Crack that loose. This we shouldn't even put that back on. I know, it's a mess. Oh yeah, I saw this one YouTuber that says, if I was your neighbor, I'd kick your ass. I was like, if I, neighbor, if I was your neighbor, I'd shoot you. <laughs> oh, nice. All right, oh, filter. Oh, filter top side. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. It looks like the same filter. Da -da -da. It should be. Maybe we did it right this time. Got to take off the freshness seal. So this was eight dollars a jug. Eight ten. Eight ten. I'm just gonna get the filter somewhat saturated. Yeah, you know, surprised the power steering hasn't gone dry. I know, right? <laughs> it's already soaking the. Um... The bolt back here for that mount. You're like, God damn. Fuck you old couch. Edit. Edit. No. <laughs> oh, is it? Hi, guys. 
This is kind of awkward. Bob, Bob, Bob Saget. Bob, Bob, Bob Saget. Bob, 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 Bob. Quint, meow. Okay, I'm filling her up with oil. Drain plug and filter in. Did you say you had a half jug? What? Oh well, yeah, I think you still have a half jug. Yeah, I'm gonna have a half jug. So he's got a half jug of this stuff here that we did left from the last oil change. Oh, you, you got, you're using that one? Yeah. Well, that means I got an extra, or? You'll have, you'll have an extra jug that we can keep for next time. Because the next time you can just buy two jugs. Alright, so I got that all snugged in the bottom. Now we're going to go up here on the top and get this one all situated. I'm going to hide that jug there. No, it doesn't even fit this one. I'm just gonna let that dribble. So this one's depleted. Got my recycling bin. Drop it. Oh yeah. Is it loose? No, I see what you're saying. If it's not this, it's that. You know, I bet we could get like a wedge or something and just pound out the firewall some more. Yeah. Or we could do a half inch body lift. Well, if we did a half inch, all right, how about one inch? Because if we did a one inch, then it would take, that valve cover would be below the cowling. It would never touch it. And then that would be right down there. Maybe yeah. that's what we're going to do. And everything else has flexibility. This is all in new joints, so I don't see why. I mean, people do like three or four inch body lifts. So should be like that. Yeah, it is pounding. Kind of <laughs> yeah. So we're going to do a little bit of a body, body lift. I think that's what we're gonna do this uh, summer, right? Maybe just do a body lift and then we'll go to the scrap yard or steel yard. Actually, probably recent, probably sooner than that because we don't want to ruin the steel valve cover. Yeah, and if we ever have to do any maintenance, we really need to be able to get that off. Maybe two inches because we'd have clearance issues. We could do a two inch, two inch body lift. Yeah, just two inches. Two inch body lift, new cab mount bushings, and then uh, I'm thinking we're gonna be doing something with the bed. Which is, is, we're not going to talk about it because it's one of those up in the air things. But, something with the bed's going to happen, so that'll need to be lifted two inches as well. So that the bottom line, at least, can match the body. So that's going to be coming up probably this spring. Okay, so. While you're at it, put a 12 out. We, no, we're, we're, no. The truck weighs 6,500 pounds. It's no, no, no. You guys in your half ton with one ton axles. <laughs> You're like. And then the truck weighs the same as this. They're like, oh, I get around just fine. I don't need a four, six BT. You're like, I'm gonna fucking slap you. Anyways. Oh my God, that even got really bad. Yeah. So, that's missing bolt up here is not. That bolt there is missing. So I'm gonna have to just tighten the top ones and the bolt the bolt the bolt or then bolts for the bottom right now. Yeah. For I want to lose this. So you just plug my stuff. I'm gonna go get a rag and check the oil level and make sure we're good. Actually um 
This is what I like about having a diesel. If it changes oil, well, I don't have to contain it. I just put it in the fucking fuel tank. Now, it's a good idea to filter this stuff out. Um, we don't really have the capability to filter it out, so we're just going to play. But it play looks pretty clean, so we're not really concerned. We're going to play Russian roulette. We'll find out now. Well, this is two and a half gallons. You didn't really burn a whole lot, so. Or leak. Or even leak, yeah. Yeah, actually, you know what the thing I was kind of playing with? What if my oil, what if my oil pressure sugar went bad? It's possible. Has it worked in this gas cluster before? Training. My nose is like, I gotta have to blow my nose here in a minute. Now everybody's gonna be like, I thought you said it was too cold to be doing things outside. Well, we are wearing warmer stuff. It's actually not that bad. I don't know what the fuck I just kicked. All the oil bottles that are luckily not. Hide up, hide up. Ah! <laughs> well, that has a nasty flavor smell to it. It looks pretty bad. It looks like we should have changed it a couple times over. <laughs> oh, oh God, this is almost Explorer front death worthy. Is it gnar gnarly? It smells fucking gnarly. And now you gotta fish for that bolt. <laughs> Ew wee! I think what I'm gonna do is I'll get a, get a towel and I'll clean off that surface real good and then we should uh, be good to go. brake light flickering. Yeah, you gotta get a LSD for this thing. You good? Welcome to the Johnson's Garage Outdoor Winter Time Bar. I'm, I wasn't talking to you. I can't hear you. You have an ear infection? Shaken and not stirred. Ah! Oh, cinnamony. Oh, it's delicious. Alright, so Adam's just fixing a license plate light dilemma that he's waited on. Help this point. I was trying to help pull a U-Haul trailer <coughs> out of a mud ditch that he's got it stuck in. And when I hooked it, when I hooked up my, the chain to the, to the head shot, I snagged one of the wires and I messed it all up. So now we get to do it again. <laughs> and then I bought this new mag light. That's using, that's a, a work light for him right now. It is getting cold. It's below 30 right now. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Hey, I got one more wire after this camera. Let me check that one. Show me if it lights up. Yep. Okay, good. All right, guys. That's going to be it for today. It, it's cold. And uh, uh, we're done. Bye-bye. <laughs>